Today is 17 June 2016. This is actually the main complaint was what? Huh? This is 10 years old, right? Huh? 10 years old, right? No, about uh, 5. 5 only, okay, so we jump down. Lift up the head and see. So, lift up. So you can see, these are all small, small pimples and rashes. Huh? Some are bigger ones. Huh? So, starting from the face, which are affected above the eyebrows, both sides. Okay, then on top, the forehead, the ears, there, ears, inside there, lift up, lift up, the, I mean your hand lift up, check and inspect, the other inside is clean, the other side, the other side has rashes also, a lot, uh, you, you gotta come this side and see, you cannot see from that side, Yeah. a lot, uh. so these are indicative of uh, bacterial infection usually, uh. okay, then we go further down, you can see a lot of rashes, uh. This is, this is what we call the generalized pustula. La. Pustula means pimple, dermatitis. Uh. Uh. And usually it's a bacteria, but it can be both la, fungus and bacteria and uh, yeast. So it goes further down. So now we, you, you come this side. So we look at the right side from the neck. You go that side and see the neck. How's the neck affected? Lift up the head. Okay, see the neck. Okay, the neck. Lift up. Very badly affected. This is scratching now because of the ear. Okay, scratching. But then you go down. Shoulder, anything? Also have it. Yep. Elbow, elbow sore. This elbow is very long already. Okay, the leg don't have. Okay. okay then we go to the chest. How's the chest? Leave out the skin. All affected. Okay. Then this side. Okay. And the back. And the tail. Tail is bad. He's been biting his tail until. Now, your, your place has a big plants, is it? Some plants. Come this side. Ah, so you might be wagging the tail and injuring, injuring the tail. Okay, come from the neck again. Okay, lift up the neck. Up, 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 up. Lift up the ears. Up. So this side of the ear is... is this side of the ear, so there is uh, actually... There, there are rashes. Huh? Inside it looks quite clean. Okay, lift up the neck. Skin. It's affected. Then the shoulder. The skin affected up to the, the elbow. I go down and go down, down systematically. Uh, elbow, lift up the leg. Below affected or not? Not so much. No, uh. Below is not so much. Okay. Mm. Then go down some more. Armpit. The lower chest. Now this part is all black. This is very badly affected. The dogs are using the leg to scratch here, so it becomes black. You see? Okay. And then here, so some are due to tick bites. Uh. Okay, lay, lay down here, lay down. Lay down. Okay, sit. 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 Okay, sit. Sit, come. Okay. Ah, then down. Down, okay, down. Down. <coughs> down. I thought it's an old dog because of the skin disease, but actually it's a very young dog, five years old. Then lift up the leg. Nah. <coughs> okay, this part is his his floor. Huh? Your floor might be very damp, a lot of dampness. Is it true? Yes. Nice. I have to sleep in the rain. Ah, dampness. So, this, this pigmentation is due to the dog scratching all the time, including the armpit, so it becomes black. And this why licking, his mouth is licking, right? Yeah. Huh? So, that is bad. So, after his, his bite, then the bacteria comes in and fungus also. Huh? Some could be allergic, uh, like his wife says. Uh. But basically, the cause is very well, uh, not much known. Uh, allergy also can present this form. But fungus, normally you can see it's the ring. Uh, the ring. I think she applied, it's why I applied some cream. So these are the fungus which have cured. It becomes white, you see there? But she can't, obviously she can't do everything. So there are some fungus here. There, these are the black one. These are old fungus. Huh? Now this one is probably full of fungus. And uh, you got to wash this also. This part? Uh? Uh, wash the whole thing. Uh, to get rid of the fungus. Then, then uh, the neck, just see the neck. The whole neck, yeah. Uh, he's been scratching, uh. He's been scratching the neck, and these are all bacteria mainly, uh. We already do the dentist scaling already. Open the mouth, show. Oh. Uh. So you continue brushing. Open bigger, uh. Open the mouth bigger. Back the back one. Open bigger, uh. Also, uh, you can continue brushing, uh. Okay. So the poor fellow looks so old, but actually he's, uh, he's young, uh. Oh, he's young, but because of his condition, very thin. I see. 
It's very thin, all the bones are. Hmm? Yeah. The ribs are there, eh? So, so this, these black spots are not natural, you know. This is due to his uh, ringworm last time. Then, then the wife applies uh, the cream. I, no I noticed she used a lot of the cream. So, when the cream is applied for quite a long time, it becomes black, you see. You know what I'm saying? The whole thing black. Uh, then some, some she didn't apply, so it is, it is raw, it's red. Uh. Obviously, this dog you need to have shape board. Otherwise, it's really hard to, hard to uh, treat. So, fungus generalized pustular dermatitis, so called. Five years old golden retriever. 